yes hello guys uh we'll be back again to this new video tutorial with the osp pro uh, in this video simply i'm going to be showing you how to make a uh, one on us uh hospital management or uh, hospital code management system uh, using php mysql uh word.js uh animated.css uh w3 css and little bit of jquery now if you try to cross check on this uh, website of ours or this system of ours when you refresh that's how the stuff tends to be uh, on our system so if you try to write maybe enter here a wrong username and password uh, it, you can't just register log you in just to say wrong username and password combination that implies uh, this is going to be called management system so it will be only recording the data from our administrator and so that implies it is an administrator to add you into the system so if you're not an administrator you cannot be added onto the system so if you try to cross check if i happen to change here and i go to admin then i can be in position so i did put that stuff here because i don't want anyone to just be using this system i would like only the administrator to be in position to use the system and if at all is to add someone he's not knows how the chain will follow to then maybe add you into the system so if then maybe i happen to type here maybe youtube maybe the person they are going to add just copy this video while youtube mm, just type the youtube also and also here youtube after doing so when you click here on registration the system should now take you into a workbench like that so this i just happened to put some blah blah stuff there so the most change you take you back refresh a bit that's how to do say welcome youtube blah blah and also tells youtube where but it also has a logout so when you click logout then the system just take you back on this first page so if you climb in here we can also take ourselves as youtube because now i'm already also one of the administrator there remember our password is also youtube something like that so when I happen to click here, now I should be in position to access the system just like that. And also, if you try to go on the next deck mini, the, the database of it, if you come on the database of the system, you would uh, actually happen to just go to PHP my admin. Uh, if you try to go to the database of the system, as where it's coming up. Uh, it should actually show us this person here will always mean you're gonna youtube and oh yeah youtube should tell us youtube so if you happen to go there and go to hoima um in my hospital management system and go to the database for administrator this is all the tables so if you go on this table here up where i believe it is for a login you'll get here what known as the uh youtube which is the person you have just registered right now and this is the password which is uh, encrypted you can't see what was then before a person happened to type in uh, his information so the password is also encrypted so members that's how i will simply say but if you love my video please just make sure you subscribe to my channel and if you happen to click down here this is just still the doctor information this part also happened to put in the database here uh, if you look down here where where there is stuff I think you can see some data within there. These are some of the data that we have there that I'm um, to correspond with what you are seeing there. And I happen to use there some little bit of uh, I use there some little bit of just CSS with uh, jQuery to make my stuff animate like that. Now this part I didn't join it yet. That's why you see the information there. I'm not coordinating with the information around here, but that's not so big because i happen to make it in other more ways so here i didn't happen to apply any i didn't happen to apply any information there but when you click here on new uh, nursing form car examination the system to take in the part like this so you give assumption i'm just going to add this person called youtube wow so he's a patient and maybe the id is a zero zero maybe four mm, four then maybe the sex is a female a female uh yeah then the phone number whatever you give him mm. so it's it's upon you uh, the phone number then the temperature i don't know there the temperature maybe the person is sick and it's roughly between uh is that the slow maybe is 30 uh degrees celsius 
and this weight is maybe uh, approximately maybe to uh, 40 kilograms mm -hmm. 40 kg or 40 you say 40 okay there are some people who are very very fat and they're very very big you may find that weight is not matter to them they can always bypass the normal weight this that's it so when you click in here you should get the information just added here definitely i think you can see the information added you can even delete the information if you want you can always edit if you want to edit you get you can always edit the information so that panel also is already created up for you and when you happen to click down here on the patients mm, when you click down on patients me shake that partition uh shake that partition where i will happen to uh, put that information there me shake that uh, shake that partition where we have that information I think you can just see roughly down here where we have that information added into our database and if you happen to cross check down here again uh, we have another information I hope you're not seeing that part just try to pause this thing and I show you what uh, down here we have this partition of the site of the system which tells us that go for doctor description and click go to doctor description the information like that should pop up for you on the system so in the doctor's description we shall be entering information basing on what we want yeah, you get but the information is very classic it's very fine very simple to understand and it's very unique you get so when i give us something here obviously we first show error at the moment but when I happen to click here, here now give a person assumption. The person name is called YouTube because that's the name of the patient. The comment may be uh, the trying to examine yellow eye or yellow eye. If that's it, just use that one for now. If I click here, that information should be added in the database straight in the description. I think you can see YouTube and the information there is yellow eye. And if you happen to come back also here, you see the same information you're going to get. The patient name is blah blah, and the sickness is yellow eye, or the, t the description so far on the first test. Then you're taken to lab technician where the lab technician is going to test your blood and urine. So you can put the lab technician name, uh, I think it's going to be Dr. OSP because OSP is also soon inspiring to become a doctor soon. So that's it. Uh, then you can also say maybe uh, you can say maybe uh, whatever I don't know, whatever test will be testing for uh, maybe if you're testing for HI HIV you can simply say uh, positive which means present mm, and you can also we can also test for what known as uh, mm, for urine we shall maybe say that uh, UTI UTI uh, maybe also present that's what the case is like all about so when you click also here we should also go back down here and you should get some kind of information to us like that so you can see this information added to us straightforward uh, which database of it is also here under medication or oh, where is it where is it where is it where is it uh, uh, technician I think you can see we are, have HIV AIDS and UTI uh, the same applies to medication you also do the same thing you put the doctor's name if the doctor's name is doctor uh, sorry mm, doctor OSP if that's the name of the patient doctor and the comment is to give in here you are to get some medication so expect you to get maybe Panadol if I just maybe say ARVs if that's the current point there now ARVs also you have to take Panadol. I don't know why every medication you have to get from the hospital they give you Panadol also. Panadol has never missed uh, any medication only in your country but in Uganda that's the first thing they will give you. Whatever you are sick what, or, or, I don't know what whatever sickness you have the first thing stuff they will give you is Panadol that's it. Now let me just also calm down here also. I try to show you around here if you try to come back here I think you can now see that's what they have given us and also now that's the medication described by the doctor for you now you have to go first of and pay before you getting the real medication real uh, tablets or real stuffs from the uh, the pharmacist so when you come back here on the cashier you have to pay now the cashier's name might be maybe uh, whatever maybe uh, 
maybe Juliet is the cashier name, no? Ah, uh, she's just our cashier. And the amount here is maybe which you have to pay is might might be maybe a uh, four hundred US dollars or well, I don't know whatever which country might be. If that's the country if in Uganda, that's forty thousand you have to pay. When you click also here, my friend, you should be getting amount paid yeah, by that person. That's the person I earn the name of the cashier. Whereby also down here, the pharmacist has now to give you uh, the, that medications and will simply maybe Panadol. Panadol. For him, his work is just going to be ticking off. So, for more, just be say given, uh, maybe ARV is uh, given. So, just to confirm that he has given you because he's the one who's going to be giving it to you uh, as an individual. The other side, these guys are just talking about it, writing it down. Then, for him, his work is to give you down uh, there. So, if you try to cross check, when I happen to click there also, you should also be in a position. Uh, that that information is already added there and if we, if we happen to go back to our system we shall be getting that when we also go to the pharmacist my friends we should also be getting this very information that i've just happened to say down there on our system the same applies to payment i think you can also see what you have just added there in the medication uh, that's what we happen to say somewhere there the description uh that's it my friends you happen you can always join up database in our system and we see how we can always make a good clever system now this system does not only going to be helping those people who are working in the hospitals but anyone who wants the format of the system kind of like that we can always make one and in addition to that also the system is kind of responsive it looks you to be uh, good so if you also happen to bring the same system on a smartphone that implies the system will be like this and i think it looks like a real tablet or it looks like a real smart a phone system i think you can see how responsive my system is like you get so it looks like really like an app you can see i think you guys you can really witness that our system looks like an app you get so if that's the system the system looks just like that which is kind of good uh, compared to what you want it takes away with 100 percent of any platform medium when where you'll be using i think you can see i think it is nice and you can also click back and i think the system takes you back uh there whereby you can also go back here you take that information and that's how it is all about so members that's it so if you think and discover that this system is very nice for you you can always write down on the comment down below i tell me uh, actually which kind of inf uh, what you can always add on this system and if the system is nice we can always see how we can make one together now for my have one mentality which i always do i don't first make a system i first make a system as individual i finish it then maybe i happen out to think down of them after i think of it on how to put it down on youtube so i first uh, do it myself then later on i happen to add them on youtube as the complete project so if you know you recommend and you love the system i would suggest maybe if possible just be if i can get just like maybe uh, uh if i can get like 50 subscribers and they're also all of them are asking for the same systems then all 50 comments from people uh for the same system then i will sit down and i will make for you this system so guys that's what i will simply say uh, on my side so if you know you're interested with me and you're interested in what i'm doing just do me a favor share my videos to people uh comment on my systems uh let people know who always be and what's all i do what i'm doing actually what i'm doing and maybe if you have anything that maybe i've not happened to understand on my programs i request you just maybe just email me down my uh email me down so that you guys i can always send you down the links onto your uh you can always you can always communicate down there yeah i believe this is gonna be nice so nice time guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe to always channel thank you love you all